The Petit Basse Griffon Vendéon, or PBGV, is a breed of dogs of the scent hound type. Although the breed appears to be designed for their winsome cuteness, in actuality, PBGVs are tough hunters who were developed for a specific purpose, to hunt small game in the rough terrain of the Vendée region of France. Their name may remind you of dopey basset hounds, but these Bassets have a touch more of a terrier mentality. As such, these dogs are brave, mischievous, energetic, fearless, and playful little companions. Also known as the happy breed, PBGVs have tirelessly wagging tails and expressive intelligent eyes and are also active and lively most of the time. Now without further ado, let's start our list of top 10 interesting facts about the Petit Basset Griffon Fanteon. But before we start our list, we'd like to take a moment to express our thanks to all the original owners of this video. The video would seriously not have been possible without them. So don't forget to check out these adorable dogs from their Instagram profiles that have been linked in the description below. And now, let's begin the list. Number 1. Their name Although their name is quite a mouthful, it explains the breed quite well by itself. The name is French since the breed originated in France. Petit means small, Basset means low to the ground, and Griffon describes their curly, wiry coat. Vendéon, on the other hand, refers to the area of France where the breed originated. The breed is known in the United States as Petit or PBGV, in England as Rafi, and in Denmark as Griffon or just Petit. Number 2. Their origin and history the Petit Basset Griffon Vendéon originated in the 1600s amid the rough terrain of France's coastal Vendéon region. There, these dogs were bred to hunt in packs, track rabbits, and other small game by scent. Petits originally came from the same litters as Grand Basset Griffon Vendéons, which are larger in size and serve as hunting dogs for big game like deer and wolves. Gradually, the Petit Basset separated into their own breed in the 1950s and were used to hunt smaller game like rabbits, hare, and sometimes birds too. The American Kennel Club recognized the breed in 1990, and since then the Petits have attracted many new admirers because of their merry disposition and tousled carefree appearance. Number 3. Their Physical Characteristics the Petit Basset Griffon Vendéon is a strong, small-sized, deep-chested scent hound. These dogs have a typical Basset-type shape, which means they are longer than they are tall and they stay low to the ground. They are also muscular through the body, chest and legs, and they sustain their energetic and steady gait through long days on the hunt. Their tousled appearance results in part from the rough coat with long facial furnishings. This, in combination with the thick, shorter undercoat, gives the dogs ample protection against vines and other creeping plants. Petits are also known for their proud carriage of their head and their large eyes with a keen and amiable expression. Number 4. They are known as the Happy Breed if remembering their long name is a problem, you can always call them the happy breed. These dogs are known for being incredibly happy almost all the time. They enjoy both human and canine company, they love nothing more than a rigorous play session with their human and dog friends. Petits also love to work, and even then, they always stay in good spirits. And well, these dogs are equally friendly towards strangers too. Because they are so extroverted, friendly and happy, the breed makes for superb therapy dogs. Number 5. They are not quiet dogs. As delightful as Petits are, you should know that according to the American Kennel Club breed standard, these dogs have a good voice freely used. In simple terms, it means that Petits like to howl a lot. They're outspoken dogs. If other dogs begin howling or singing, your Petit will join them in no time. Petits may howl alone or with a companion, they may howl to music for fun or in protest at being left alone. Long story short, these dogs just love howling. In fact, PBGV parents report that sleeping dogs have been known to immediately awaken and howl along if their favorite song is played. Number 6. They are excellent in hunting and tracking. Petits have a great hunting and tracking instinct, having been bred to do the same. In the Vendée region of France, these dogs were used to flush and track rabbits in the bramble, sending rabbits out into the open where the hunter could take them with a shot. As a result, even as companion animals, their hunting instinct may manifest in the house if they see birds, squirrels, or cats. And as scent hounds, Petits don't even need to see small animals to chase them. Just the scent is enough. They are natural athletes and they can run fast and long if they catch the right scent. This is why you need to know that this instinct will be a little difficult to overcome even with early training. Even the most obedient ones will give a chase if they find a scent. Number 7. They're escape artists. 
The breed definitely needs a fenced yard, as all it takes is one enticing smell for them to be off on the hunt. But since some Petis are scape artists, you gotta be sure that the fence around your house is at least 4 feet tall. Even electric fences won't deter these dogs if they see a rabbit or a squirrel just beyond the boundary. The momentary shock is most likely to go unnoticed, as these guys will go off wildly running after their prey. So make sure you have a yard that is strongly fenced and is tall enough to stop your Petit from jumping off. You'll also need to regularly inspect for holes or areas from where your Petit might be planning to escape. Number 8. They are an active breed Unlike the other hounds in the same group, like the Basset, which is typically laid back, the Petit Basset Griffon Vendéon is an active breed. Petits are very curious and are always ready for new adventures. Walks can be a great way to exercise them, as long as you don't mind adding plenty of time for extra stops dedicated to sniffing. But remember, Petits cannot be simply turned loose in the yard and expected to exercise. They'll likely just sniff around idly. If you show interest, they'll happily play games and go all in for hours. While these dogs don't mind their fair share of lazy days, but if you just want to snuggle with your pup, the breed is not the right one for you. There are simply too many exciting smells for your Petit to stay indoors all day. Number 9. Their Grooming and Care the coat of Petit Basset Griffon Vendéon is one of their most distinctive qualities, but it can also be a source of frustration for those unaccustomed to dealing with it. Their tousled appearance at the same time is part of their charm. Their coat is supposed to be harsh and thick, but even then, you gotta brush your Petit thoroughly at least once a week. Most people follow a bathing and grooming routine on a monthly basis, which includes a good thorough bath and a nail trim. Some owners also clip their Petit every few months to keep their coats more manageable. Also, remember to wash your pooch's ears weekly with a gentle vet approved cleanser to prevent infection. Number 10. Their health concerns one disease that a Petit Basset Griffon Vendéon is prone to is epilepsy. There's also a condition known as primary open-angle glaucoma in which dogs suffer from bouts of pain, mostly in the cervical area of the neck. Most Petits outgrow the problem, but some can suffer permanent complications. Fortunately, a genetic test for this condition is available. Petits can also develop neck, back, or knee issues, as well as hip and elbow dysplasia. So make sure to talk to your dog's breeder about the dog's glaucoma status, as well as all the other possible health risks. Alright guys, with this we've come to the end of our list of top 10 interesting facts about the Petit Basset Griffon Vendéon. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you already own one of these amazing dogs, do let us know about them in the comments below. Please leave a thumbs up and share the video if you liked it. For more interesting facts on different dog breeds, click on our channel and don't forget to subscribe. See you guys in the next one.